Well, driver, I guess this is gonna be the end. No, 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 Oliver, don't even say that. Your fireman and I are gonna come up with a solution to help you stay alive and find a railway for you so that way you can run again. But how though? It's not like there's another railway that only has like steam engines but a few diesels. Actually, there is a railway called the Northwestern Railway on the Eye of the Sodor. The station master told me during the day while we were there at the station that it is a sanctionary railway for steam engines, but there is a few diesels, but the majority of them are steam engines and it's not going to be likely to change in the future. So that is our only chance. Now that's a railway we gotta go to, driver, but can we bring Toad and Isabel along with us? I don't want them to be left behind. Sure we can, Oliver, sure. Huh? Who was that? Oliver? Is that you? What are you doing here, Mr. Oliver? Well, we're going to Sodor, so that way we won't have to get scrapped. And I'm taking you two with me so we can start on a new journey. A new home. Are you sure that we'll be able to make it to the Sodor without getting caught by anybody? Yes, we will make it because the fireman actually printed out a copy of the schedule. The train starts at 4 and it ends at 9. There is a hideout throughout the way, so we can use it and then we can make it to Sodor. Well, that is the good news. Guessing we're all ready. Right, let's go. Then the single man from the disused quarry line has some news for us. Well, the manager from the GWR has sent diesels down the line to find you, but luckily they don't know that you're here, so that is a warning that you may have to watch out. Well, that is the very good news for now, but aren't there any other diesels that come through the night as well? Well, that I do not know, because if I were to ask that to the manager, he'll probably suspect something was up, and I don't want to do that, but if you see one diesel or two, that's probably a good strain heading to another location, though. Well, I'm guessing that the chances are 1 out of 50. 
Well, I guess that you are right on that one, Oliver, but it's our only chance to get to Soldor. Let's hope that I won't get spotted throughout the night time. Well, I guess that I wish you luck, and don't worry, you will find a way out. Although I did have a doubts about it. Um, driver? How come we're not moving? Well, it appears that we ran out of cold. Um, driver? Did you hear that? Yes, and I don't think that is a steam engine. <laughs> Ah, a steam engine. What are you doing here all alone at the single house? Well, I um got broken down and um they had to call us and um um there was supposed to be an engine coming here to uh, collect us and uh take us back to the sheds. <laughs> Judging by that the manager has never told us about it, I'm guessing you're escaping from scrap, aren't you? Well, this might surprise you, but I want to help you. Wait, what? You want to help me? Yes, yes, and because I don't know, I just felt that um, it isn't right for just steam engines to get Scrap, you know. Yeah, yeah. Um, it's because I never heard a diesel said that to me before. And, um, thank you very much. Yeah, yeah, um, I never expected to hear that from a steam engine. But let's take you to this old abandoned area I know that you could be safe there for now. Don't worry, I know this kind of looks like a scrapyard area, but you're not going to be sent to the scrapyards. I can make sure of it. Well, yes, um, thank you for everything that you did to help us to make it this far, and, um, what is your name? Well, my name is Joseph, and I suspect you are Oliver because your driver have said it to you, so, yeah, um, I gotta go, um, it's nice meeting you Oliver, and don't worry, you're gonna make it. Well, I was there for many, many years there, and losing hope that I'll ever get to Sodor, but suddenly I heard the sounds of an engine I have never heard. Wait, wait, did you hear that, driver? Oh boy, I guess this is the worst place for a steam engine to get scrapped. And it even reminds me when I was escaping from Scotland all those years ago. Well, I guess that's it. Don't want to be here any longer. Well, that's odd. That's coming from a steam engine right there. <laughs> Who 
Who's there? Are you a fat controller's engine? I am proud of it. Well, I'm Oliver. I'm here with my coach Isabel and my brake fan Toad. We're asking if we can come with you as well to the island of Sodor. But what are you doing there? Escaping from scrap. I'll be glad to help you, and as might as well, you get a better be look for scrap by taking you away. And that's how it went, and the rest is history. Must say, Oliver, that was a great story and really shows how hard you tried to get to Soldor. Well, indeed, despite the struggles throughout the way, it was worth it to get here. Well, we are glad that we are here, Oliver, and we are glad as well that you are part of the Northwestern Railway. All the engines, including Oliver, agreed. Oliver was glad that we was, he was able to find a new home for him, Toad, Isabel, Maribel, Alice, and Duez, as well as the auto coaches and slip coaches, a new home so that way they can be part of the Northwestern Railway as well as be a part of Duck's branch line as well.